Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. My name is Melissa. I am super excited. Um, hello if you're new here. Um, I'm super excited today uh, to share with you guys two Enchanted Fandoms unboxing. I am working with Jess again, so I do have a coupon code. Um, I did actually pay for this stuff. I just get a discount on it, so it wasn't like sent to me for free. But I will always be honest with you guys um, and let you know my true feelings on these boxes. I am so excited to get into these. Um, but as far as Enchanted Fandom goes, I will link the boxes down below. Um, or uh, I will link the... I will link the website down below as well as my coupon code is down there if you want to use uh, use it and save yourself 10% off. I am super excited. So I actually, um, so this is their monthly box and I forget the theme so we'll get into this here in a minute. But I think I'm going to get into this one first. Um, so I already did open this one. Um, I had actually went and ordered one of their past drink and vessel boxes. Um, now their drink and vessel boxes have went to bi-monthly. So every other month they'll have a new theme. Um, February theme is Kingdom of the Wicked, which I believe it's based on the book by Carrie Maniscalco, um, which I don't own. Um, it is a book I want to read, but I, I don't own it yet. Um, so... There, it's going to be a campfire mug as far as I believe. And those ones are on sale right now. So if you wanted to grab yourself one, um, you can also use my coupon code off of that um, and save yourself money. So I did order a mug, um, one of their past drinking vessels. It goes with a set that I have two of. Um, there's some more to the set, but I haven't gotten them all yet. Um, but I also asked Jess if she had any extra recipe cards, and she did. So she sent me the ones that I don't have, and I'm super excited to add these to the collection. There's quite a few here. I'm going to add these to my collection, so when I do my Bake With Me videos, which hopefully I don't have time to film one today, but hopefully later in the week I'll have time to film one. Um, but I have more recipes to add to it. I'm super excited. So thank you so much, Jess, for sending these to me. Um, I can't wait to use them. So <clears throat> let's get into this. So I forget which month this was, but it is. Oh, I'm so excited. Uh -huh. Ooh. It is uh, Manon and Dorian from um, the Throne of Glass series. Oh, I love it. And I have uh, three, two other ones, and they all, like, stack together, which is so nice. Uh, they're so cute. I love this one. I need to get the other ones, but I just could only get one at a time. Oh, and also they include a recipe card. Um, so you get the, an alcoholic version and a non-alcoholic version, um, included. So you can do either or. So yeah, so I'm super excited to have that in my collection. Just set that, set that right there. All right, now we're going to get into the monthly boxes. Um, I can't remember the theme. I think it was hero versus villain. Um, if I remember correctly. I've had this since Saturday and it's been tormenting me all week because I didn't want to film until the boys were in school because they like to be nosy. And it's kind of, it's really hard to film if I'm not doing like a vlog or something. It's really hard to film like this um, when they're around. So, so sneak peek. Whoop, everything's falling out of me. Sneak peek, there it is. Okay, so let's look at the first thing. And, oh, it says, um, it's not my fault. I can't interp interpret your emotional Morse code. And it's a Wednesday Adam candle. I, uh, me and my husband just finished watching Wednesday Adam. Loved it. Loved it. Can't wait for the next season to come on. Look at the sparkle. 
Oh, I can smell it. I can't, my, if I sound stuffy, I am a little stuffy. Um, it's been, the weather's been crazy here, so it's been getting warm and then hot, or warm and then cold. And so my allergies have been going crazy. But um, this has lots of sparkles. Smells amazing. Don't know what it smells like, but it smells amazing. So there's the first item. I love that. I love Wednesday Adams. Okay. Sorry about that, guys. I had to blow my nose. Okay, so then, okay, I think, yep, this is the spoiler card. It says it's a beautiful day to fall in love with the villain. <laughs> villain vibes. Um, and it, it is hero, <clears throat> hero or villain, there's the spoilers. I'm not going to look. I'll refer to it as needed. Um, and then, oh, the next, this recipe is Smutty Reader's Dirty Chocolate Chip Cookies. That sounds amazing. Um... Ooh, I am digging this. Another recipe for the, the recipe cards. I'm super excited. Oh, this one sounds so good. And then we have a beautiful bookmark. It says, new day, new chapter, new fictional character to fall in love with. And then on this side, it says, I'll, I'll be your villain. Super pretty. Oh, and we have like a card. Um like a little card and it's Maven Galore. This is from the uh, Red Queen series. I actually didn't care for this series. I ended up DNFing it because the third book, I got into the third book and it just really irritated me. So I ended up like, the first two books were really strong and then the third book just irritated me. So I never did finish the series, but I did like this character. Um, so there he is in all his glory. I love artwork. See if I can set them up there so you can see them. All right. And then the next thing is Persephone's Garden Club. I think this is like an air freshener. I don't know what it's from or who it's from. I'll look at the spoiler card here in a minute. But that's pretty cool. Then we have... Oh, let me put this right here. Then we have, I have crossed oceans of time to find you, Dracula. Oh, it's a mirror. This is so cool. It's like a little, I actually needed a new one because my mirror fell out of the one that I had. So this is going to be perfect. I love it. Now here's the back. It is really, really pretty. I, I'm super excited about this. This is really neat. I needed one of these. Thanks a lot. I got one now. All right, let's get into the next thing. It looks like we have a patch, and this was for from Novel Grounds, and it says Romance Reader Club. Cute. Love this. Um, but it's really pretty. I like that. I tried to do like a, a jean jacket with a whole bunch of patches on. It never worked for, for some reason. Like my patches would not say. It just irritated me, but this is really cute. Um, really like that. Then we have a reading notes notebook. Um, so you can like start it, finish, title, author, genre, quotes, and like you can just track it and stuff. That's actually really cute. A little notepad. So, yeah. Oh, no, you can't have that, honey. We'll put this stuff right here so. I can't put it very low because, here, let me show you. Say hi. Yeah, say hi. <laughs> With chapstick in her mouth. <laughs> Somebody likes to, some, uh, some little girl likes to grab things. So I can't put stuff very low. All right. So the book, <clears throat> the book is the Vern, Vernum City Series, Book One, The Lazarus by Marlo Locker. I don't really know what this is about. I'm going to read the back. So it sounds really good. Um, there, It's definitely going to be like a dark romance. Um, there's villains and stuff. And it's it's kind of like vague on like what it's really about. I mean, it's about definitely about there's romance in here and definitely two people that are seemingly going to fall in love, but there seems to be some very dark juju going on. Um, 
I, I don't know. It sounds very, it sounds really good. So I'm actually pretty interested in this. Um, I think it's, it's definitely, this is definitely, um, an 18 plus book, um, from what I understand. So it's definitely not for younger audiences. It's definitely adult. Um, so, and I'm pretty sure it's a dark romance, uh, novel. I honestly, I don't really know a whole lot about it. Um, but it does sound good. So I definitely will give it a go. Um, it also includes a signed book plate from the author, which is always nice. I'm going to stick that in here so it don't get lost. And then it also includes a little letter from the author, which is always so nice. So yeah, so that's the book that was included in this box. I'm super excited to give it a try. Um, I believe she doesn't always include books in her boxes. Uh, sometimes it's just book like goodies and stuff. Um, so I think that's how it goes. I, it's been a long time since I've got these boxes. So, so yeah, I'm going to have to hope relearn the whole thing, but I am super excited. Um, when, especially when a beautiful book is included, I always like new books. Um, so, so yeah, I'm actually really excited about this. Um, I think my favorite was, uh, my favorite item was either the candle or the mirror. I love the mirror. Like, I really do. Okay, guys. So, I'm going to look at the spoiler card and give you guys a little bit of details on it. So, like I said, the patch is from Novel Grounds. Um, the character card here, this beautiful character card, was created by Re Barden Art. Or Re Barden. I think um, she's on Instagram. Um, she does very beautiful artwork. Um, I do like. I think she's also the one that did the these cups, but I'm not 100% sure. I will look into it and let you know for sure. Um, and then the, let's see, the book, oh, hang on. The little notepad was designed by Enchanted Fandoms. Uh, the Dracula mirror, let's see, the Touch of Darkness car air freshener, and the Wednesday, whoop, Sorry, baby girl. And the Wednesday Adam Candles were all also by Enchanted Fandom. And then the bookmark and the spoiler art card and uh, was also designed by Enchanted Fandoms. So that was everything in this box. What was your guys' favorite item? I am torn between... The Dracula mirror and the Wednesday Adam candle. Only because I love the way it smells. It smells amazing. Um, but I also love this because I need a new mirror. Um, so I'm kind of torn. I don't know. What was your guys' favorite item uh, in this box? You'll have to let me know uh, down in the comments below. Um, that is everything that I have for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this little this uh, video. Uh, I can't talk today. I got so much on my mind right now that I've got to get done today. Ugh, it's going to be a day. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, this box definitely was worth it to me. Um, I enjoyed pretty much all the items. I think the car air freshener, I don't know what it smells like because I cannot smell for the life of me. Although I did smell that candle, so I must be able to smell a little bit if it's a very strong scent. So, um, so I don't know what this smells like, but... When I put it in my car, we'll find out. Um, but yeah, I enjoyed actually everything in this box. So you guys will have to let me know what you guys thought. Um, if you enjoyed this box. Is it worth the price to me? Yes, I, I believe it is worth the price. Um, but anyways, that is all that I have for you guys in this video. You guys will have to let me know what you guys thought. And what your favorite item was down in the comments. Thank you guys so much for watching. Yeah. Mm. You silly girl. You're such a ham. You're such a ham. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I will see you guys in a new video soon. Say, say, bye. Say, bye. Yeah, bye.